buddy. So those ladies there are Team Sugar out of Utah, and I will talk more about them in a future video. There's kind of a weird thing that happened. I was supposed to make a video about Utah today. However, I had a hard time doing some editing. So guess what? Today, you guys get to hear me talk about how difficult this editing stuff is. Further, you'll get to see me ride a random ride here in Boise, Idaho. And uh, yeah, so without further ado, let's get started. The breakfast. Mm. All right, we've got our green smoothie done. Let me tell you something about Boise and where we live. I live about 10 minutes away from work. I go that way. And I also live 10 minutes away from the hill. In fact, Tono's not with me today, but I am going to head up right now and get a good workout. So, uh, I'm going to take you guys with me. This is going to be a super quick video, but uh, I'm glad you guys are along. I remember as a kid, my stepdad had one of those old school slide projectors, and every so often we'd have slide night. I seem to remember always enjoying it, uh, but once I got older and saw some other people's slideshows, uh, I couldn't stop thinking about what kind of excuse could get me out of watching those stupid slides. So I'm not trying to be that slideshow dad, in essence, uh, boring the world with my videos, but I definitely, definitely want to show as much as I can about our life. Pretty exciting. I started this video with the footage of the ladies mountain biking club because it speaks to a couple of things. First, how awesome and strong the mountain biking community is and how grateful I am to be a part of it. Secondly, how hard it is to make YouTube videos. I started working on that footage a few days ago and have been having a heck of a time editing it down to a great story. So that footage was taken in Park City, Utah about a week and a half ago. I had totally intended to get this video edited as my second episode for this season. Well, as you can tell, that didn't happen. At this point in my filmmaking career, I'm boiling this whole process into Howdy. just four, what seem obvious to me, steps. One, planning. Two, filming. Three, editing. And four, posting. So, let's start with planning. Obviously, everything starts here, right? First, I try to think about what story I want to tell in my video. Then, I try to plan out a rough draft of the scenes I'm going to need. Third, I imagine, although I should probably write it down, all of the things I'm going to say throughout the video. Four, well, unfortunately I'm not very good at this yet, so mostly I just wing it. And as I learn more, winging it becomes more of an educated winging it. With planning, I often wonder too, do other peeps have issues? One issue that seems to happen more than I'd like it to is that it looks great on paper, but once I start filming, it just doesn't translate. Another issue I've found is, well, either planning too much stuff or not enough. Man, that one bites me so much. I also tend to forget stuff, like lighting or good audio. Stuff like that can really ruin a video.
The last thing I can say about planning is that I can almost always salvage a video. It may not be perfect, but if things have gone really wrong and I've gathered enough material, I can usually make something out of it. So that's it folks. Planning is the first stage, at least to me, of this whole filmmaking process. Um, once I've done a really good job planning, I seem to be able to pull off a good video. Um, so in future videos we're going to talk about filming and editing and posting, but for now we're going to go ahead and finish this video up with a beautiful ride down Red Cliffs. Alright, see you in the next video guys. Peace out.